The Low Country takes its sports very seriously, which brings us on the ice at the North Charleston Coliseum for some Stingrays action. Thank you, boys. Well, Andrew, congratulations on your season opener. That was a fantastic blowout. So tell us, this is significant in Sting Race history. It was very important because our home opener, we usually have a really good crowd and it's our 30th season. So to get off to a good start, yeah. it was exciting. Um, and I think that carries forward to our the rest of our season, our home games. We had some fans that it might have been their first time at a Sting Race game. I imagine they want to come back. So it was it was a very important first game for us. Yeah, you, you sold the you sold the brand, you sold the team really well with that first game. The first game here when you come out and just the atmosphere, yeah. it really gets guys excited. Sure. And you could tell right from the start we had some big hits. And you got some good players on the team too. So besides yourself, obviously, anybody else that folks should be keeping their eye on? Uh, if you like watching there are skill guys. We had young guys like Johnny Evans. He he scores some exciting goals. If you like the big hits and fights, we got Evan Wardley on our defensive core, um, and then our goaltending has been outstanding as well. You've got some exciting games coming up in the future too. So which ones are you really pumped up about? As a player, I I, I don't get too far ahead. Uh, you kind of just think of the next game. That's the most important one. Uh, take it one game at a time. But it, it's important to keep winning at home, keep the fans engaged, yeah. um, and then the, the really big events where we have pink in the rink or the, the teddy bear toss, those ones are extra special because this place gets pretty full. It certainly is, and actually we're going to be meeting up with the Creative Services Director about some of the upcoming events we're really excited about, so including teddy bear toss, pink in the rink, and a lot more. I want to thank you so much, Andrew, for bringing us here, letting us sit rinkside. How exciting is that? Katie, we're so excited to be here at the Stingrays, and we just heard about the fantastic season opener that you guys had here, but you've got a lot of events that are coming up. So why don't we start there? What are some of the dates that people should be marking on their calendars? Oh yeah, um, so this is our 30th season. We've been in the Low Country for 30 years. We're actually the longest tenured ECHL team. Wow. This year we want to make it special, try to really get our uh, local organizations, nonprofits, businesses all involved. In November, we have a three game weekend. It's going to be huge. It's our first frothy night, so $5 frothy beard beers. Um, and then we have our kids' takeover game. We just want like a bunch of families to come out. Kids will be doing like some of our jobs. You'll see them dropping the puck, uh, kind of announcing scores and stuff. Oh, so it should be really fun. Oh, that sounds like fun. Yeah. And then you've got some big things coming up in December too. So wonderful Correct. holiday giveaway. Yeah. yeah, so we have our fan favorite teddy bear toss. Um, every year we try to collect as much teddy bears and then we end up donating them later on uh, to local organizations. Um, just around Christmas time. Oh, that's so, great. Yeah. So after the Stingrays score their first goal, everybody in the stands, hopefully this is all filled yeah. with uh, teddy bears and it's really fun because you see the players picking them all up yeah. and kids are throwing the teddy bears, so it's a it's, great night. It's amazing how something so cold as an ice rink can warm your heart. Yes, yeah. <laughs> and then once the holidays have passed and things have calmed down, you've got another big event coming up in March, which is something that everybody waits every yes, year for. Yes, our yeah, annual Pink in the Rink night. Um, yeah. It's going to be really great. We're actually doing uh, pink giveaway to rally towels this year, and we're going to have pink specialty jerseys. Nice and that we're going to actually auction off and the proceeds will benefit Share Our Susie, so we'll be giving back and just honoring those. Um, That's great. Yeah. Well, speaking of jerseys, you also have awesome hats. <laughs> I love this beanie, by the way, but you've also got some other really cool merchandise. Yes, um, definitely come by, shop at the Reef. Uh, everything that we have is online, so you can just go. Um, get what you want and you can find it on our website. And season tickets still available. Still available, yeah. You can All save right. money, a lot of fun perks, team events, so definitely check those out. All right, the puck, it drops here, folks. Thank you so much, Katie. Yeah, thank you Good so much. Good to see you. Yeah. We're back after this.